Welcome back to our channel and welcome back to watching us. This is Aiden, I'm Dan, and this is Funko For Us. I don't let Aiden talk enough and that is my fault. Uh, not to embarrass him, but I just talk a lot. Um, I'm really excited, I'm passionate about things. So we're gonna do another unboxing, but this time I really wanna let Aiden kind of run it. Half run it. <laughs> So one of the things that we do is uh, we've got an order from Funko.com here and we've got a, I believe that probably is a Facebook Marketplace order that I did. Uh, she, sh I'm going to say she, I believe it was a she. Uh, and shipped it in an Entertainment Earth box. It said fragile. The box is damaged on the outside. It says, it says handle with care on the top. I don't know. I don't know about the kind of beat up. Okay, so it's double boxed. Hopefully it's not Rick and Morty spacesuit Rick. <laughs> ah, okay, yeah, this is a uh, Facebook order. Uh, so we did this on Marketplace, found uh, uh, a lady selling a couple different ones, had one that Aiden was looking for and had uh, two that I was looking for. So these are kind of just something um, that we're doing, we collect for ourselves. And so uh, I've been kind of pieced together. I am a big uh, Superman fan. And so uh, not too sure if I like the little packaging that it's in, but that's okay. Uh, individually wrapped in little things. Uh, it's got a nice little sticker. So this is the Justice League AAA anime exclusive Superman from Justice League. I already said Justice League, but that's okay. Uh, I've got a variation of this pop. Um, this is the flying version, I believe, is what made it the AAA anime. Because um, the crouching is just the regular. And then in black and white, right? Yeah. Okay. Well, the black suit Superman is from the... Snyder Cut. From the Snyder Cut. Yeah. Yeah. Good point. And then yeah. there's two versions of that. So there's crouching and flying of both versions. Cool. Yeah. And I do have, I know I, I know I've got the crouching black. I think I have the flying black as well. I have the flying black. Ah. That's what you're thinking of. Okay. Cool. What else did we get in that box? Oh. Another one for me, evidently. It's like Christmas. <laughs> Okay, so this was kind of an add-on little one that I did. Uh, this is Groot with Stormbreaker, and stupidly enough, I bought this without asking Aiden. Uh, he has this one, and little did I know that he didn't want it. Yeah, I just put it in the cell pile. Uh, I like it, but if I were to have, it's my only Groot that I have, and I'd like to get just a better, like, standalone Groot, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, uh, there's a ton of Groots, so we've kind of figured it out. I like this one because it's got Stormbreaker. That's one of the reasons why I like it. But let's move on to the third one. Third and final one. It's a One Piece one. And what do you know about One Piece? Uh, what do I know about One Piece? It is one anime that you love. Okay. I know that the pops are very hard to get. Mm -hmm. um, and I've paid pretty much extra for almost every single one of them. They all instantly sell out. They all, people love them. So this one's Jinbei. I believe he's introduced in Fishman Island arc. Um, I've, I have not got there yet. I'm episode 260 something. He's like 500 and something. Out of a thousand, I'm, I'm a decent ways away. Uh, but I like this one. It's a cool mold. I have almost all the other ones. I don't have the big ones, like from this recent line. I don't have anything like the six inches or anything, but yeah. Yeah, I if I remember right, this was one that I saw at Target one day because I know I bought you. No, I wasn't there because I know I got the Zoro and the Snake Man Luffy that day, and you had asked if there was a Jinbei, but I don't remember. So there was the, there were all three there. Oh, maybe they were. Okay. Yeah, I told you only to get the ah. Zoro and the Luffy at the time, but then I wanted it because I'm filling out the set now. 
Makes sense. Yeah. So with that, I, these were the two that we got. This one was kind of the freebie from this order, but really all in all three good pops. Uh, so now we're going to move into our second box, which is another Funko.com order. Uh, Aiden asked me if I knew what was in each of the boxes and I had to say no. Uh, we did so many orders in the past few weeks um, that it kind of got a little bit uh, too much. Um, this one should be some sodas. Get rid of the tape there. You should have taken a picture of the stack of boxes before we oh, unboxed these. There good was point. like, there was five boxes. They were just going all the way up to the, not all the way up to the ceiling, but like, it was filling up half of the room. Yeah, yeah, it's kind of fun. Uh, two of them came, three of them came while I was out of town, so when the wife saw it, it wasn't too good. But yeah, so this is our order with, uh, Fix It Felix, finally, I have been, we're not big on sodas. Well, we weren't big on sodas. <laughs> we weren't big on sodas. Now we're really beginning into them. And Fix It Felix was actually the one that I've always wanted. And so now that uh, we were putting an order together, he was there. I believe it might have been on sale, but maybe not. But finally got that. So we're going to open that up here in a second. But what did we get in the actual order? I believe this was a mixed order for both of us. Yours. For me. Ah, okay. So, okay, good. <laughs> I wanted to pick up Ned. So this is a Walmart exclusive, Ned. And you say, well, why did you order it from Funko.com? At Walmart, all of the Neds that I have found do not have the sticker. Weird. So I wanted to actually have the sticker for this set. Um, so yeah, kind of a neat way to do it. Um, it's in essence when he's got Dr. Strange's cloak. Also, if you're buying them from Walmart, the boxes are probably beat up, honestly. Yeah, we, we tend to run into that. So, okay, let's see what's in there. Oh, two more for me. That's all right. Uh, okay, so We'll just leave that one. Yeah, you could show them. So in our other video, I already unboxed one of these. Uh, I ended up buying one more of the Nick Fury from Secret Invasion, hoping that maybe this might go up in sale, uh, up in price, and maybe be able to get a little bit of extra. Uh, and this one came back as a back in stock Funko.com exclusive. Um, I have actually, Wally was one of the first, uh, one of the first at least 10 Funkos that I ever got. Um, the original Wally, the really small one. And then I've got the bigger one. I got the 10 inch. And then I've got most of actually this line. I don't have Mo. That's all you're missing, I think. Yeah. Other than the movie moment with yeah. Yeah. both of them. Um, so I like Wally. This is, he's dancing with the hubcap, kind of a neat little one. So I'm gonna let you open up the soda. Get the crack in. I don't need that. You don't need that? Okay. I'm a big boy. Let's see. Now you wanted the chase because that's the one where he has the hammer in his arm. Yeah. To try to get it out. So I'm not looking at it. Not one. looking. Not looking. Hey, while we're waiting, if you're into farming chickens, bees, and goats, uh, kind of a plug on my other channel. Uh, on Our Hidden Acre is my other YouTube channel. Um, currently right around 960 subscribers. Would love to get to that thousand over there as well. So maybe you want to go over there and check that out. I'll link that below. But let's see what we got for the soda. I'll be happy either way, but yes, I would love him to have his hammer because it would make more sense. I've been feeling around on this one and... Uh... No chase. No chase. Yeah, he's holding, he's holding nothing there. Just holding nothing. Okay. But you know what, though? He's I still like super it. cool. Yeah, I still like it. It works well in the soda style. This is one that, yeah, I feel he's better as a soda than he is as a pop. Um, and that's why we have not bought any of his pops. Um, well, the Pog's not that good, though. That's weird, but that's okay. Well, the pog is whatever artwork was on the front of the Oh, game. yeah, okay. So now I've got to find the chase, but that's okay. We're happy with it. I didn't really want to collect too many sodas, but here we go, kind of just, you know, getting into it. 
we're doing this for ourselves. Uh, so uh, this was pretty much all for me again. Pretty much. But that's okay. That's what adult money is fun for, right? Uh, but what are some other Funkos that are coming out or what we're looking for? Maybe some grails that we just recently have seen that you're really wanting to get. I was talking about it in another video that I want to get the Batman villains right now, like his rogues gallery. One of my like big ones right now is Mr. Freeze from the the DC Collector Core box. I forget what it's called. Um, it's like fifty, sixty dollars right now. I don't really want to pay that, but we'll see. Yeah, we'll see. That's a good one. Uh, we were just watching a video. Uh, I've always loved Ghost Rider, uh, the comics. And the original Ghost Rider from 2013, I believe, Funko Pop. Um, it's a really, really good looking pop. Uh, I would love to get that one. That's one of my grails. Um, so what's, uh, let's see, what's one of the favorite ones out of what we've got today? Uh, most of them all for me, of course. But is there any uh, that we got that were, that were favorites for you? Well, yeah, um, we kind of put the other ones out of... This one's for you, but I do like the Wanda. I really like the mold, and I just think it's a good representation of like that scene. It looks just like from the movie. Yeah. So. Cool. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for watching. Uh, we appreciate it, and uh, make sure you're subscribing. Check us out more. Make sure you're following us on Instagram. You probably already are because if you're here, that's where we you probably came from. But thank you so much. Have a great day, and God bless. Take care. <laughs> cool, cool, cool. cool. <laughs>